Hi, I'm Suzanne Mashtu. I'm Don Disanaka. And we're from STEM Centre Australia. We just completed our really exciting course, School Girls in STEM, which was designed to really boost girls' interest in STEM-related fields. And this was um, for us to really contribute towards gender parity in STEM and to inspire girls um, about the endless and exciting possibilities that uh, STEM really offers. And the way we designed this course, we considered all the important aspects in science, technology, engineering and mathematics. And in that, we considered um, a theory and a practical aspects to go with that and also real life applications. Mm. Um, we align the content to the Australian curriculum and, uh, and develop the content in an integrated manner so that uh, students could uh, follow a longitudinal approach. Yeah. Um, and the expertise coming from industry and also the research backgrounds yeah. in, in developing these courses. Yeah, definitely. So the course uh, started with empowering girls to uh, really realise their full potential and this was just applied to generally in life but also specifically within the STEM disciplines. We then went on to a maths puzzle and this then led into learning about robotics and coding using our MBOT and following on from that uh, focusing on circuits, looking closely at a battery and acids and bases, then going on to chemical reactions and from that looking closely at chemical reactions within the body and also energy flow in the body too. That then led on to uh, learning about electromagnets and following on from that we ended on a real high note, uh, literally, by flying our drone and um, able yeah. to look at the forces. I think that was quite exciting yeah. where uh, students were able to look at the forces acting in a flying object yeah. and then how the control mechanism works. I mm. think uh, they really enjoyed that aspect. Oh, they just yeah. loved that. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, so I believe overall the girls really gained so much from this course, um, not just the educational and the practical aspect, but again, um, realising and recognising that they can achieve anything they put their minds to. Definitely. Yeah. And in STEM Centre Australia, we are consistently developing more courses to, um, to targeting our school kids. And uh, yeah, so watch the space. Yeah, definitely. So girls, what's the process of slime? Tell me what slime is. So it's when the agent, the linking agent, also known as the borax, is going with the polymer, which is also known as the glue. So when they link, they become slime. Alright Ishva, what have we done over here? So basically we've taken a copper wire and we've wrapped it around a nail and then we've sticky taped it to a battery making um, it a magnet. So if we take these magnetic paper clips, they should stick. Give it a bit girls. Excellent flying. You got an obstacle course. Alright, we got our slime. Hey! Alright, girls, so how did you find our school girls in STEM course? It Amazing! Was, it was great, I loved it. It was really fun to learn about like mouse intestines and like learning if they're healthy or not and learning about like science and technology. And there was a really hard maths puzzle that we finally figured out. We got to learn about polymers, ions, many things that most of our people don't even know about. So it was really fun with the experiments. Great. Well, I personally loved learning it because it was like we'd learn about it and then we'd do a practical, like this one, we're learning about polymers and then we made slime. So it was pretty cool how we did, how we learned about it and then saw it in real life. And so for all the girls out there, please join, it's so much fun. Yeah. Congratulations, Ishva. Congratulations, Sahana. Congratulations.